In football machines, they are now all different shapes and sizes, but they've lost very little of their skills. The Italians controlled the midfield and created opportunities, but they were initially denied by the agile goalkeeper Andri Arense. The hosts also managed to put together some decent passages of play, but they played as individuals rather than a team. Roberto Galia eventually broke the deadlock late in the first half, while Salvetti added a second in the second half, pouncing on the rebound. The final score, 2-0 to the Italians, but the big winner, the Nelson Mandela Children's Hospital. I feel very, very happy because today is a, is a great day for the children, for the hospital, Mandela Hospital, and we are so proud to be here with our mighty mate to make this possible. I think it was fun. We all doing it in the name of Madiba, you know. Uh, the results don't matter today. It's all about Madiba. It's not about who won. But we all enjoyed ourselves. Some of us have been kicked the ball for the last six months, but we, when we were invited, we had to come and, uh, and salute uh, Mr. Mandela. And the fans saluted the veterans or masters for their efforts. Temba Shiba is ABC News.